The agreements were reached at State House in Dar es Salaam after the arrival of President Paul Kagame of Rwanda, who was in the country for a two-day visit, following an invitation from his host, President John Magufuli. Upon his arrival at Mwalimu Nyerere International Airport, President Kagame was given a guard of honor before witnessing traditional dances. <laughs> Later at State House, the two leaders held talks and witnessed the signing of cooperation agreements in various areas, whereby President Kagame said that Rwanda has set aside 1 trillion francs for construction of a railway line from Tanzania border to Rwanda in order to improve transportation services. Our visit and the agreements signed today represent our desire for continued partnership and closer collaboration on issues of mutual interest in all sectors. The President and I have had good uh, discussions, building on the spirit of friendship, strong historical ties, and the future aspirations desired by Tanzania and Rwanda. On his part, President Magufuli said Tanzania has a lot to learn from Rwanda, including on revenue collection through ICT, and assured Rwanda that the port of Dar es Salaam will work efficiently with no bureaucracy and corruption. Nafahamu Rwanda mnatikaribu wa asilimia sabini ya bidha huwa zinapita kwenye bandari ya Dar es Salaam. Almost 70% of Rwanda's goods come through Dar es Salaam port. There are some challenges of facilities at our port and corruption which frustrated traders using Dar es Salaam port. There were also other barriers on the road including numerous checkpoints which discouraged traders. We have made efforts to address many barriers such as reducing road checkpoints from Dar es Salaam to Kigali to only three. Meanwhile, President Paul Kagame of Rwanda says that East African countries need to put concerted efforts in production of high-quality goods in order to improve the market for the products in the region and attract foreign markets. President Kagame made the statement in opening the 40th Dar es Salaam International Trade Fair at Mwalimu Julius Nyerere Grounds.